Hi, in this video we are going to talk about custom views, how we can create them, how we can display them and even how we can delete them. Suppose this is my data in a sheet where I have sales data and I want to display different type of data to different kind of people. So this is uh, my data and I want to see the complete file, right? But for my manager, I don't want him to see these columns. So how I can do that? To my client, I don't want him to see the sales. What is the sales amount? So I can do one thing. I can always go to my manager and then before uh, showing him the file, I can hide these cells, right? Or hide these columns or then again unhide them. And then again, when I go to my client, I need to hide this column. Suppose if sometime I forgot to hide, what will happen? So to uh, eliminate this problem, what we can do is we can use custom views. So suppose this is my view. I want to see complete file. So I will go to view section, view tab. Then I have an option here, custom views. So I want to see the complete file. So I will make a custom view for myself first. So I will from here add, then I will give it a name myself. Then I will press OK. Then this will view, this view will be fixed for myself. Then I don't want these columns to be seen by my manager. So uh, what I will do is I will first hide them by selecting them. Then I can right click here and then hide it. So I want my manager to see the file like this. Now after doing whatever I want to do, I will just go to again view custom views and then I need to add a new profile or new view which will be my manager. So I will type here manager and then click OK. So this view will be uh, seen by my manager only. Now I don't want my client to see the sales. What is the sales? So I will hide this column also. And suppose if I don't want him to see the discount which we are providing. So I want these columns to be hide. And then this is the table I want to show him. Then I will save this view for my client. Now from here I will again add a new display or view for my client and then save it. Now what happened is whenever I want to see file for myself, I will go to custom views and then select myself and then click on show. Then I can see the complete file, right? Every data is there. The file is completely unhidden. There's nothing that is hidden actually. So this is the view that I want to see. Suppose if I go to my manager, what I will do is before showing him the file, I will just go to custom views and select manager and then select show. So the file will look like this when my manager will see it. Now if I talk to my client and he asks me for the data, then again I will go here and then choose client and then show. Then I can show him this file, right? So this is the actually advantage of using custom views. You don't have to hide and unhide every time you go to client or manager or for yourself, right? Now if you want to delete custom views, how you can do that? You can just go to custom views, then suppose you want to delete the client view. So select the client, then go to delete. There will appear a dialog box. It will ask you that you want to delete or not. Click on yes and then that particular view has been deleted. Now suppose if you want to delete manager view, go to delete again, it will ask you, then click yes and then it will get deleted. Now you will have only custom view for yourself. You want to delete it, you can delete it also. I think that's pretty much about the video. Thank you.